Today we are exploring Dermator National Park. Well, at least a little part of it. We saw online that there's a lake here, a glacial lake that's really, really popular. It's called Black Lake. There's been a ton of snow, but the roads are pretty clear. So we were able to drive most of the way here and then just walk the rest of the way. We haven't seen it yet, but already this is such a magical winter wonderland. Today is a little bit warmer than it has been because we were absolutely not prepared for the snow. <laughs> I mean, we obviously knew it was going to be a little bit colder because we're higher up in elevation, but it's April and we just left Couture where it was like low 70s. And then we're originally from Florida, so Florida in April is like a little different 90 degrees already. This guy doesn't even have a jacket, it's a proper jacket. <laughs> I didn't know we were coming to all this because so we travel full time so everything we own is in our suitcases but we don't keep things so Ian actually gave away his jacket in Turkey jacketless jacketless it's okay because today it's beautiful this is pretty crazy I've never seen a place like this that's for sure and these mountains are Absolutely phenomenal. Yeah, they're really beautiful. Well, and the blue sky helps a lot. So <laughs> the last couple of days it's been very cloudy. There's not a cloud in the sky today. This is not what I pictured it would be online. Crystal blue. Yeah, and like all green, but this yeah. I think is better maybe. Airbnb host recommended not walking because from our Airbnb you could normally walk and it's about a 50 minute hike through the woods but he looked at our clothes and our shoes and he was like no you need to drive there because he was like you'll he was trying to explain that we would sink like I'm doing right now yes me too I'm still on my snowman I'm making a unicorn you're making a unicorn does it look good yeah it's yeah. pretty cool I really like mine he's like the best snowman I've ever made like this before but what are these tracks we keep seeing what appear to be deer tracks but there's also massive like are there bears here probably possibly I'm assuming I don't know if you can see these tracks right here they're pretty large it's either a fox or a wolf I'm voting for fox though where and those the claws oh yeah those paws are cool and then there's more it's leading Emerson thinks she's so funny. She was like, oh, mama, look, look at this plant. And she knows that I'm interested in like plants and things. She's like, no, you can't see it. You can't see it. Come close, come close. So I bent way down here and then she shook this tree on top of my head to get the last of the snow. Oh, Emerson. It seems like every corner we turn, there's a different, really spectacular view. <laughs> <laughs> we just keep like taking more and more photos. And yeah. I'm like, oh, that's a good view. Oh, wait, no, this is better. It's really, really great. Every place we go, though, like, I'm like, I want to see it in the summer, too. Yeah, this place would be crazy, I think, in the summer with all the green and vibrancy that I'm sure is here. Not to mention the bright blue lake. Totally different. I can't get up this. <laughs> <laughs> Got it. Okay. Oh, good job. Yes, thank you.
taking advantage of another gorgeous day out. So we are heading to Terra Canyon, which is the deepest canyon in all of Europe. At the bottom of the canyon is um, the Terra River. We've seen photos online, it's pretty stunning. This is gonna be fun. It's really dry. There's not really any snow here. We came down quite a ways on the way here. The elevation changed a lot. Didn't really know what to expect, but the trees are all dead, so it's not the most scenic thing in the world, but the, the bridge is, is cool. I'm confused because I don't see the river. The Terra River is supposed to flow through here, but maybe it goes even deeper. Maybe that's yeah, why it doesn't so. look very deep right here, but like on the other side, it gets deep and there's a river. You have to fly your drone in see what we can't see. And there's jam. Jam. Tanik, Kamalina, Belarusia. Thank you. Dobachip. That's really good. He had some bottles where it was like actual flowers inside the bottle. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It's really good. And it was only five euro. I'll eat that. <laughs> In Montenegro, they use the euro, which is interesting because they're not a part of the EU, EU but I guess they're trying to be. So their currency is a euro. Ems trying to give us bloops. Today we are on a bumpy road and <laughs> and stuff. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I don't know what this says, but it looks cool, right? Oh, I saw a bear! I saw a bear run! No, you didn't. Run! Run! <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Into the woods! Into the woods! 